Simmons, celebrating 150 years of quality sleep. Time brought to you by Simmons, 9 p.m. This is News Tonight. Good evening, I'm Glenda Chong, and tonight's top stories. Financial help will be provided to those who suffer serious side effects after their COVID-19 vaccination. At the same time, coronavirus testing will be ramped up. Hotel staff in contact with those serving stay-home notice will be routinely screened. Unpacking the costs of the high-speed rail, Singapore has already spent more than $270 million on the derailed project. And at the same time, a main concern leading to the termination has been made clear. Also tonight, the new school year begins, but due to COVID-19, only Primary 1 and Kindergarten 1 students reported for class today. Singapore will provide financial assistance to those who suffer serious side effects after getting vaccinated for COVID-19 here. Testing will also be ramped up, including for high-risk groups like hotel staff. The co-chairs of the Multi-Ministry Task Force on COVID-19, Ministers Gan Kim Yong and Lawrence Wong, have laid out Singapore's plans to combat the virus in the first parliament sitting of the year. They cover four key areas. Vaccination, testing, safe management and contact tracing. Now, first, a look at vaccinations. A financial assistance program will be rolled out to support those who suffer from severe side effects after receiving the shot. <laughs> 